Hello and welcome to Bosch TV, Ian here. Today's menu is looking like a really good one. If you like Mexican food, this is a treat for you. Today we are cooking Tinga Tempeh Tacos. Tinga is something that usually you'd have with chicken, but we are pairing it with tempeh today. Now Tinga is essentially chilies, tomatoes, onions, all slow cooked down to form a really nice, rich, Mexican-y, spicy sauce. And tempeh is made out of fermented soybeans. It's kind of a bit like tofu. It's kind of a bit like nut roast. It's packed full of protein. And when you cook it properly, it is truly delicious. You are gonna love this. First up, heat some olive oil in a pan. Pop in your tempeh and give it a good stir so it warms through. Oh, looks good, doesn't it? Really tasty stuff, this. Now add in one white onion, make sure you slice it really finely. Get a bit of salt in there as well for flavour and to eke out all the moisture. And once it's sort of caramelised and browned a bit, get some garlic in there, cumin, some cinnamon, and give it a good old stir. It'll look quite dry at this point, but never fear, because you've got some fine tomatoes, which are laden full of water, which will wet up the whole thing. Now, maple syrup will give it a nice kind of sweet edge, and the chipotle paste will give it that really nice kind of Mexican deep flavour. Now, once that's there, you get your vegetable stock cube, and then get your water in there as well. Give it a good old stir, so, to, so it's like really nice and moisturised. And then, so it's really nice and wet, and then just let it simmer down. Just simmer, 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 simmer. And it'll be thick. And once it's thick, you're gonna need to season it to taste. Now, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, even some chilli flakes if you want it spicier. Once that's done, you're basically ready to roll, except for this. Now, guacamole is one of my favourite things, and with this, you need two big avocados, the juice of one lime, four spring onions that have been sort of like really, really diced really, really fine, and then some jalapenos for a bit added kick. Now, guacamole wouldn't be guacamole without a decent level of seasoning. Salt and pepper will do this job just perfectly. Season to your personal tastes. Now, coriander leaves. If you don't like coriander, leave it out, but I think it's amazing, and also it just adds really nice freshness and colour. Now, once you've done that, get your corn tortillas. Corn tortillas are so good, but what you need to do is make sure you cook them according to the packet guidelines so they're nice and soft. Get your avocado on there, get your tinga on there, get your crispy lettuce on there, and then dress it up with a bit of chilli for lovely colour, obviously lovely flavour. Get some lime on there, and look, I mean, come on. Oh, and there we have it. Teesby's Tinga Tempeh Tacos. Super easy to make, so delicious. This just would go really, really well with a beer. Shall we find out what Henry reckons? Mmm, it's good. Absolutely delicious. The guacamole in there is gorgeous and the gentle heat of that tinga is perfect. Well, that is an absolutely banging taco. Hopefully you guys will love this as much as I do. So guys, if you're gonna make this, which we absolutely hope that you do, send us some photographs and mm. tag us in your pictures on Instagram and we will try and re-tag some. Mm. Drop some comments down below. Hopefully you love the video. Big love to you all. See you later guys. Bye bye.